Here we go. How's your A? Did you play in class this week? Yes. And how'd it go? Very good. Uh huh. Take all your etude things first and we'll plow through those. Yes. Yeah, okay. We did separates and square uh, four. Okay, great. Okay, so let's see how, can we just start with our warm up with four stops per bow? That's good. Sometimes I think your fingers can be a little bit closer to the tip. That's right. Two, three, four. Good. And feel the arm heavier. Good. That's right. Good. So, and listen to the ring. And keep your hand over your high dot. Good.
Good and. concentration to read those notes, doesn't it? Two, three, up.
good, 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 good. Sing that, girl. great it will be. What do you think? If you did two times with stop bows and then two times with slurs, you're going to be done with it by next week and then we get to go on to the next one. Does that sound reasonable? Okay, very good. So you can give that to your dad. And how is your shifting book? We have harmonics this time, don't we? Right. Okay. Oh, but look at the angle of your bow. You really want the bow to come this way. Now, if you were a cellist, that's how you would play with your bow. Yeah, cellists, well, cellists are like this. Do you see? So that angle is good for them. They can't play like this because that would hurt their wrist. So they're like this. And, and flat here, too. But for us, we like to play the flat here sometimes over to the other side. One, two, and think of the beautiful sound. One, two, three, to the frog. One, two, three, four. Okay, so now the hard thing here is to play one, two, three, and then count one, two, three, four. And how many beats do I put in each half? Four. Four, right. So how about from here? Good, really reach here. One, two, three, four, one. And find the lightest finger. Two, three with a beautiful tone. Three, violin up. One, two, three. Uh, 
balance your bow, press in the longest finger. Good. Now, your bow's a little like this, so hard that you have to rudder it back. Good. Good. Now, and then we want to listen to that D, how much resonance it has. without touching my bow. You can touch my finger. Uh, Which finger is going to pull the bow back? Thumb? No. Well, we only have four other fingers, so <laughs> go one Pinky. at a time. Hmm? Pinky? Yeah, see how I can pull it back? My pinky is my rudder. Do you see how that works? Good, so. Right, that's right. Three, four. And rudder it back. Good. Two, three. Loose bow can stay loose. And back. Oh, oh. Good. Oh, did you see how you can back it up? That's it. Two, three, four. And bring your thumb with you. Three, four. And back it up. Two, three, four. 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 Fine. Good. Now we want to find the clearest sound for the E. That's it. So these, can these guys stay looser? Good. So even looser to four. Three, loose. Good. And four. That's it. So it's going to be comfortable. That's it. You hear the clarity of the sound? Okay. Okay. That's fine. So let's pass you on this one. And we're on to this one. You know, I bet you could do the whole thing. It's pretty easy, too. Uh. Okay. Oops. Should I put this test to make sure you do it? Okay. So, try, can you see if you can get through the whole half a page? That's very good. And did we finish off? We finished off number one, right? Yeah. So, we're on number two. We don't really need that book, those pages anymore, right? Because we have a real book. Is this we your dad's? Was this your dad's book? Can I go? Might have even been my dad's book. It's ancient. <laughs> Can I go? Okay. We can always tell if we can find a price. Dollar twenty-five. Yes. Yeah. Probably what I paid for mine. <laughs> okay, so we're doing number two, right? Uh, yeah. Okay, so let's do the code first. Uh, 
your pants to augment your allowance and not diminish it. Mm -hmm. Do you get an allowance? Uh, I, I, I save my allowance. Uh-huh. Good. They don't give me. She earns it. Okay. Okay. So if you ask it's for birthday, Mark. if you ask for a raise, you're going to augment your money, right? Yes. Which means what? You make it more bigger mm -hmm. and if if you don't get a raise and and the birthday money is drying up you diminish which means it gets smaller right so an augmented second means it's a second that is what bigger bigger it's a half step bigger so also another name for an augmented second is a minor third yeah i've heard of that okay so augmented second equals a minor mm -hmm. three. Right. Okay, so are we doing number one and two? Uh, we're doing number four. Okay, okay, so let's go with that. Are you doing eight for both? Yes. Okay. Very good. Now, can the bow be even more beautiful here, Jess? See how the bow is just hugging the string. Good. Now, can you go from one to four? Good. So, so we start on open. So you read it a few times? Uh, once. Oh. One day. We spent one day on it. Okay. Okay. We so maybe we'll once. do a few measures and so you'll figure out what we want to do. So we're starting in what position? Third position. Right. 
good. Now, look at your boat. You don't want to be a cellist. Well, maybe you want to be a cellist, but you're playing the violin. Good. So we'll go down bow. Twice as fast, so they would be called what? Um, 16 plus 16 equals. Seconds. Yes, those are 30 second notes. We just learned about them in this class. Oh, great. Okay, so.
So we'll start the trill, we'll start the trill. reviewing first movement so we get you an entire concerto again mm -hmm. one of our um, mistakes for the second movement was we didn't have her listen to it so much she, she knew the first and third movement like the back of her hand because mm -hmm. we have them on all the time but it didn't, didn't occur to me that it's, it being in a different book and different CD yep. meant we didn't but it's okay it's so good not to hear it because then you have to figure it out yourself yeah Okay, let's hear your A once more. thing is is that you can't put too much on and seems like it's more potent yeah is that a little dab will do you yep yep this is justin's favorite sound you don't make that sound <laughs> okay are we ready good 
it. So we really want to get to the tip. Good. 
Well, that was really good. That that was really good. Now, why do we want to leave that three down? So that we're not like bringing out a tune. Yeah, and we're coming. We're going to come right back to it right away. So we want to be very lazy with that finger. And 
good. And then softly to then each one a little more. The middle initial of Baroque is decay. See how I lose? I can disappear on my down bow. Fa, fa, fa. Good. Fa, fa, fa. Fa, fa. you can leave a little space. know it better than you give yourself credit for it. Let's try it. Watch your feet. Good. Ba, ba, down. Good. Let's keep going. That's good.
have the whole piece within a, a few weeks. How does that sound? Good. Okay? Okay. Give your fingers more credit than you're giving them. You know, in your practice, even without your dad there, you can just kind of, you know, kind of they remember just for fun got it got it okay questions no no okay really good good Sadie okay 